guys, how you doing? It's Henry at Mowers and Blowers. Welcome to another weekend product review. I got this thing in the mail the other day. That's a mighty big box just to put this little thing in there, huh? Now why do they bother putting that in there? Like that's gonna do anything. Anyway, I got a new propane torch. I had a few of these before in the past, but they're always the ones where you have to uh, hook onto the big propane tank. I'm hoping that this may have the option of doing the big propane tank and the little propane tank. Uh, because the big propane tank is always really heavy. About 15 pounds, you gotta carry it with you while you're doing it, you know? You use a propane torch to light up things fast, your fire pit, um, if you have weeds that grow in between your pavers on your walkway or your driveway or your curb, you know what I'm talking about. It's a pain to get that out. People just burn the weeds right out of the crevices. Also, if you have a lot of oil drippage on your driveway, which most guys that work with small engine equipment or mechanics do, uh, there's oil spots all over your driveway. And if you want to reseal it in the winter, you gotta first burn the oil off and you use a propane torch to do that. This propane torch is better than the ones that I used to have, why? Because this has a button where you click it and it ignites instead of having to use the, the flint clicker to light the propane or a lighter. You know, this one has a built-in trigger that ignites it. Let's uh, open this up and see what, what it looks like. So this is from Bravex Performance. Bravex. That's kind of a cool name. <laughs> I get a lot of products from uh, Asia to review. Most of the names are ridiculous. You can't even pronounce it. You're never gonna remember it. But Bravex, that's pretty cool. Good job. And I don't really, I don't really tell people it's a good job unless it's actually okay, you know? Okay. <laughs> it's like a flamethrower, huh? Uh, comes with instructions. I don't really think I'm going to need any instructions. And a tool. Coolio. So here's, of course, holy cow. Here's the torch. Here's the mechanism for the flint, not the flint, the uh, igniter. Ooh, okay. Let's see if you guys see that. that it has a knob where you can turn on the propane turn off the propane and then you can trigger it to allow the propane to come out never had one like that before that's cool um, the line looks like a six foot line and the attachment looks like it connects to a small bottle which is great because I don't want to carry that big bottle around. Let's go get a small bottle and see if this fits. Like I said, I got different kinds. This still has about one eighth in here or a quarter. It has your typical nozzle on here with a, a knob that turns on the uh, propane. Once you have the propane coming out of the uh, nozzle, you would ignite it with one of these flint lighters that um, and you also have the even smaller ones usually people use these for camping see and then you make sure that it goes to blue kind of a big flame 
blue is when it's the hottest. But then when you turn it off, you got to just turn it off, you know? So it's, I wish I could just click it like that, you know? So I'm going to remove this nozzle. Well, actually, I'm going to try this one first because this seems like it has more in it. Well, doesn't fit. The nozzle doesn't fit. I got the big one out. That's it. These are the only three sizes that I uh, I know of. These two should be about the same nozzle, but it doesn't fit. And this big one here, I don't think it's going to fit either because the big one's nozzle looks like that. Oh, wait a minute. I think that does fit. <laughs> hey, how about that? Maybe. So red's going in the wrong direction? Is it going the other direction? Oh, it goes in counterclockwise. Looks like it does fit. But not all the way. Okay, this is the last propane tank I have. I had to take it out of my barbecue grill. <laughs> um, I sure hope this one works. This is full. And it's about 13 or 15 pounds. Let's make sure this is closed. Dealing with this stuff does kind of make me nervous this could explode and you'll die you know all kinds of reasons okay I'm gonna turn it on okay you could turn this on and it comes out this knob here controls that. So you can turn it on. Ignite. Wow! Holy cow. Ooh. Holy cow! Holy cow! So when you trigger it, that's what happens. Holy cow! Uh oh. If you have weeds like that growing out of your driveway. Holy cow. Uh, don't burn your good lawn.
That's crazy, man. These always bothered me for the longest time. try to get out some of these oil stains too. So there you go. The Bravex propane torch with igniter and trigger. Just what I wanted for Christmas. You can burn out oil stains on your driveway and get rid of those pesky weeds that are growing out of your pavers or your curb. Really cool thing to have. Or you can use it as a flamethrower. I'll leave a link in the description if you guys want one. <laughs> Go check it out, it's super cool. Just be careful and not burn your whole head off. <laughs> See you guys next time on Mowers and Blowers.